This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good afternoon, folks. I'm Steve Roger, uh, 1 o'clock uh, guest filling in for uh, Tommy O'Brien. Right now, we've got the Dow up 65 points. S&P is up 9. So all the indices, with the exception of the transports, are trading to the upside. Up uh, the NDX, well, actually, it's the semis that are up uh, 12 points, nearly 1% out there. Uh, the Dow is up a quarter of a point, uh, slightly more than that for the S&P. It's up about 9 points. The NDX up 30. So what is it that's important about uh, where we're trading right now? Actually, what's really interesting, you've got gold at 1291.70. Let's start there for a moment. Now, it was traded at 1291.40 just a moment ago, just a few pennies. What's interesting for me, and I think for you, about this 1291 and change area is that on a weekly basis, it's called Stevie's Green Line. Right, blank screen. I don't know what to tell you about that. Um, if we take a look at uh, what uh, gold is doing, trading right into resistance. So we don't have a breakaway just yet. In fact, it will really be tomorrow's close. This is a weekly chart that you and I are looking at. And you're going to want to see a close above uh, 1292 is the uh, number. We'll just use that. We'll forget the change out there. Now, with regard to the markets themselves, it's really just, uh, well, really three markets to be focused on. It's the NQ the NASDAQ 100. The reason is because we've had, we've got two competing patterns. We have a potential for an A to B equals CD to the downside, giving you a price projection of 70.51. We're at 72.51 right now. But if we get a bullish reversal signal today, meaning if we close up, uh, I don't know, around 72.70, that's all that it would take, uh, then that's going to be a signal that we may have a bottom. Now, I say may because we have the Rhodes Momentum Indicator signal that's way up at 7401. Really what it would mean to me if we get a bullish reversal signal today is at least a rally up to that 7401 level. The other indice, or in this case here, equity futures contract to follow, it's going to be the Dow. You'll also see today the Dow and inside trading day, but uh, we're trading at 25,190. You get up to about 25,2 something. Uh, what we will see there is a bullish reversal signal. It too has the same types of patterns. So right now, what the market is doing at one o'clock in the afternoon, it's trying to figure out whether it wants to set that hook for the bull move up, in this case here, 25, 536, or whether it wants to make the ride downstairs, 24, 476. Folks, stay tuned. Steve Rhodes, that's me. I'll be up next. We'll take a look at more details of these markets. Take care and have a great day.